Had it been the people of Niger are saying, maybe they don't want what is happening. That is where I would say, okay, fine, intervene. But this one is that the people of Niger are not even complaining. They are not complaining. They are saying that, yes, they are happy about the latest development. They are happy about it. They are not, they are not angry. They are in support. So why are you trying to fight them for what they are supporting? I did a video about uh, Niger that President Bola Ahmed Tinubu is giving them an ultimatum, seven days ultimatum to release the president and also return him back to power in seven days or else they will face the consequence. Now, I, will, I promise to give you latest update on that news. You know, there's a level you will get to in this content creator that you don't need to be under the sun again. You have your umbrella, you just stay under your umbrella and freestyle. Yes, sun is beating me. So I have the umbrella. If the sun comes out, I will open the umbrella. Now, share this video and follow my page before I say what I want to say. Because most of you are watching the video, you just watch the video, you scroll. What is What will it take you if you click follow and follow my page? What will it take you? It will not cost you anything. They won't debut you. Just follow the page and also share the video. Let everybody be aware of what is happening. Don't be selfish and keep news to yourself. Dalla, please. Now, the latest update is that this thing, you know, when I advise Tinubu to remove his hand, the people still comment and say, ah, he's doing his work. Now, he's not the Echoas chairman. You see the reason why I'm saying this thing is not our business. It doesn't concern us. Now, Mali, Burkina Faso, and Guinea are saying that any military intervention that gets to Niger, any raiding that the ECOWAS are planning to raid Niger, that if they do it, that they will be attacked. And that is what they are. See, when I say leave them, is it not what they say they want? Now, for instance, Hadibung that now Guinea, Mali, and Burkina Faso, they have said that if ECOWAS intervene, that there will be a battle in Niger. They will brush them. And that is what they are saying. I don't know who is giving them the morale, but what, as far as I'm concerned, I know that these people, they have morale already. Somebody is gingering them and pushing them to it. Because this thing I'm saying, leave. My, pro my own is that had it been the people of Niger are saying maybe they don't want what is happening. That is where I would say, okay, fine, intervene. But this one is that the people of Niger are, are not even complaining. They are not complaining. They are saying that, yes, they are happy about the new, latest development. They are happy about it. They are, not, they are not angry. They are in support. So why are you trying to fight them for what they are supporting? They made a complaint. They say that they have natural resources like uranium that they use to develop lights. But eighty percent of the citizens in the country are suffering from lights. Me, my own is that there should be peace. Some people that have not experienced crisis, they want to test it. They don't understand that it's not right. Crisis is is dangerous, pa. <laughs> it will help you to take your country another year, another years backward but what is happening in niger is for us our politicians here to learn this is not the era in life that you will keep lying to your citizens we will do this we will do that we will do this one and they will vote you you will not even do anything the moment they elect you you have disappeared we didn't see you again learn from what is happening because now if you lie to your constituency, you don't fulfill what they vote you for. When you come back, they will chase you away. Yes. So you have to, I like what is even happening so that our politicians can wake up. They can learn. Yes. If you don't learn, if, if people get angry, it's your business. So now Burkina Faso, they have a, 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 a Niger, the leader of the, the military, whatever, that took over has given an order that they should stop the export of uranium to France. 
I even learned that uh, I don't know. The thing is that if this is what they say they want, leave it for them. According to me, I don't know my own opinions. That is what I feel. That is what I think. If they say they want that, leave it for them. That's why I'm begging our president to remove his hand. Because this one now that is not our business. It doesn't concern us. The next thing, Burkina Faso, Mali, and Nigeria are tell, indirectly telling us that, guy, if you put your hand, we will, we will bite you. Yeah, that is the sea finish, giant of Africa. That is what they are telling us now. And you know, we they have been jealous of us for, for, for a long time. Instead of us to respect ourselves and leave them to do their thing, we are checking our mouth. Me, I'm giving updates. I will keep bringing updates of the Niger matter. Yes, all you need to do is follow the page so that you can get updates. Share the video when you watch it so that the video can go and others can understand what is happening. This is not a time to sit down and be watching only Big Brother Nigeria. I be Big Brother Esther. Watching EK and Messi and the rest of them. This is a time for you to be informed. It's a time for you to be informed. If I'm trying to tell you what is happening, so people will still watch video and say, this man and Shahib will not have sense. Waiting in the truck, waiting concern, you go and face your job. I don't have work. This is my work. My work is to read news and interpret it in a video for you to see it. Because you don't like to read, so but you like to hear. I'm telling you now, Mr. Share the video. I don't have sense. I agree. But I am the spice creator. This is something you cannot take away from me. Google me if you like. Don't Google me. I'm out of here.